Hello. Uh, yes, I am in a bathrobe because I'm very comfortable. I'm going to be focusing a bit more on data science related jobs. And so I figured I'd be making some, maybe some videos that are similar to that. And in, in that vein, I am not on hacker rank. You'll notice that I'm on something called CodeWars.com. It's a similar platform, but they offer SQL challenges. And that's why I'm, I'm here. Uh, Nathan loves cycling. Because Nathan knows it's important to stay hydrated, he drinks 0.5 liters of water per hour of cycling. Get you you get given you are given the time in hours, and you need to return the number of liters Nathan will drink, rounded to the smallest value. For example, three should re a time of three should return one, 6.7 should return three. Okay, so you're rounding down. So you're um, okay. So and you have to return three columns, ID hours and liters, not liters with a R first. Okay. All right, uh, so here we have select all. This is just the default that I'm given. So I'm just going to run sample test and see what the data set looks like. All right, so we have ID and hours. Okay, so we need to do we need to add another column to this. So I I, I actually need to figure out how to do SQL um, round down. <coughs> Um, so you can use floor. Okay, so I think I'll use floor, and I think I can just add another column here, floor, and I use the hours, and times 0.5 or divide by two, and I need to call it, I need to call it something, liters, L-I-T-E-R-S. Let's run the sample test, and it worked. Woohoo! Okay, cool. So. Uh, <laughs> It's been a while since I've done SQL, um, so let's run. Let's give the attempt for the full test, and that works too. Okay, cool. So um, you have to submit a final, but uh, that's basically it. Okay, so that's pr pretty straightforward. Um, so if this is the kind of stuff that you're looking for, um, definitely you know leave a like and also subscribe if you're if you enjoy any, any of my content, just so I know like I'm doing something worth doing. Um, anyway, uh, I'll be doing more of these. I'm also going to be focusing on some some other related content that's around data science. I'm still trying to figure that out. But um, anyway, until next time, see you.